guys welcome to Jordan just a few minutes ago we landed here in Amman the capital city of Jordan and if you clicked on this video because of the five dollar tickets that's right the flight cost only five US dollars but we're gonna explain a little bit later but first but first we need to get some stuff for our Arabic friend so and if you're wondering why we're buying cigarettes if we're not smoking we're gonna explain that later as well So guys, we have arrived in our hotel here in Amman and if you are wondering about the interesting uh, ride that we had and about the cigarettes and the booze, the thing is um, our friend recommended a friend here in Jordan, here in Amman, who basically offered us a free ride from the airport to the city center uh, where we were staying in exchange for some duty free products and that was what we did, just a free ride to our hotel. If you're wondering how we managed to get the 4 euro round trip tickets, the thing is that Ryanair just opened a new route from Cyprus to Oman and as a promo sale they did a 2 euro one way ticket. So basically we just bought it 2 months in advance. Now actually when the route has already open, been open for a month or so, they're doing the promo again and now it's just 1 euro for a one way ticket. I don't know how they make money, but it's awesome. Always follow these sales and always follow the sites or blogs where people feature all these awesome deals. Sometimes you can fly around Europe for as little as 2 euros or 4 euros round trip. That's how we got here. <laughs> and what is also awesome, the place that we are staying. Oh, that is totally awesome. Ooh. Yes. You see it by the background, right? It's a pretty dope background. <laughs> and what's also cool. We are staying here at the House Boutique Suits. The location is absolutely perfect, right in the city center. And the price that you pay for the service that you get is of exquisite quality. But you know guys, less talking, we'll just show you around. Oh my god guys, do you see it? It's just beautiful. Right now we are on the fourth floor where they have a pool and uh, like a chill zone with a small bar, with a shisha bar and you can just come up here, relax, enjoy your time and watch over the whole city. You can see the whole city is just really beautiful. Alright, so I'll just show you around. So there's the bar. Here's a big huge chill out area. There's Linda sunbathing. There's a pool. And there is another chill area. You know what? I thought it's gonna be really hot, but it's not. We're just used to the Asia hot and humid weather, I guess. And well, we're in the middle. We're in the middle of the desert, so I thought I'm gonna burn here, but it's coming. So the city seems to be really huge wherever you look there's a, there are buildings around and it's just enormous one thing that i really miss is my drone so the thing is we are not able to bring our drone with us because jordan has really strict rules and regulations regarding drones and 
you need a permit from civil aviation if you want to fly and bring your drone into the country otherwise they will just confiscate it uh, from you when you reach the airport first observation it's freaking cold <laughs> we already got goosebumps the thing is uh so the thing is during the day it's around plus 32 degrees celsius but right now it's around 23 and it's really strong wind and there is no sun so it gets really chilly actually here on the rooftop and what's also interesting during the night uh, the temperature would will drop as low as plus 16 or 15 degrees so it's getting cold do you have any comments on this weather? I'm freezing that's why I'm texting constantly <laughs> it helps a little bit <laughs> So it was really freezing outside, so we just decided to go back to our room, do some work, and then in two hours go out for some nice dinner. Who thought that it's gonna be freezing during the day in the middle of the desert? <laughs> Guys, look at that sunset. We are finished with our work, and we're just gonna try to run upstairs and quickly catch some glimpse of this gorgeous sunset. Let's do this. Sunset was incredible. It's still happening there. You can see the clouds just exploding. The all the different colors look so beautiful, so stunning. And I truly have to say that this sunset is one of the best in a really long time. Whew. So it's around 7:30 right now, and people are breaking the fast, and everyone's heading out to eat. Basically, during Ramadan, most of the time, well, depending on what time sun sets. You can't eat from around 7.30 in the morning till 7.30 in the evening and then you can eat the whole night. So all the eateries are closed during the day and opening up again in the evening. So the city is like coming alive. We're going there and we want to experience that. <laughs> So we found a very, very popular and highly recommended Hashim restaurant here in Amman city center. A friend of ours that we met recommended it highly. So basically, we, we've got hummus, we've got falafels, we've got bread, and we have all kind of spices, french fries, and some oily mixture to dip the bread. And all of this costs around six Jordanian dinner, which would be about seven euros, I believe. This is a really popular place. It's crowded now, full of people. And the food here is definitely gonna be amazing. So we're taking a little bit of this hummus. Mm. It's actually good. I'm not a hummus falafel person, really. But this is good, wow. Now I do understand vegetarians though. Let's try a little bit of this. Actually, I have no idea what kind of thing is this. It's like oil with like beans, chickpeas. Oh, it's hot. Mm, spicy. I think it's chickpeas with some chili and some beans. It's also like a sauce. Oh my God, guys! This whole meal was so huge as well hummus and everything was served on, with olive oil on top so it's quite fattening as well we just couldn't eat the whole thing but it was really really nice and the total was uh, six Jordanian dinner as I said which is seven euros or around eight dollars for two people so that's a really really good price here in the very city center of Oman all right guys so this is it for today I hope that you enjoyed this video and tomorrow, tomorrow we are showing you a lot more of Amman, the city, what you can see and what you can expect from the city. 
Guys, if you enjoyed this video, please give us some really big thumbs up. Subscribe if you want to see more of our trial videos. And guys, we're gonna see you tomorrow. Bye!